Recently, we talked about different types of bolts and their unique applications in the automotive world. I briefly touched on bolt grades, and we didn't really go into much detail because we're gonna do that today. Now, there's other ways to identify a bolt, mainly the size, meaning the length and the diameter, but also the thread pitch, and we're gonna learn how to do that as well today. The first thing we're gonna talk about is grade. These two bolts here are either grade one or two, and you can tell because there's not any marks on here that indicate that they're any stronger. Now, these bolts will handle about 60,000 to 74,000 PSI. These three bolts are grade five, and you can tell because it has three marks here. Now, this is pretty typical for automotive applications, and typically you don't need to go to anything that's weaker than this. Grade five is a good go-to. Those grade five bolts have a tensile strength of about 120,000 PSI, which will handle most things on a vehicle. But if you need something stronger than that, the next step would be a grade eight. The way you can tell it's a grade eight bolt is by the six marks here on the head. I know it's getting kind of confusing because a grade five bolt has three marks and the grade eight bolt has six, but that's just the way they grade them. Now it really doesn't matter the other markings that are on the head of the bolt, like if it's a shape like a triangle or different letters, that just signifies the manufacturer. Now a grade eight bolt will has a tensile strength of about 150,000 PSI. Now a neat little piece of information is that these stainless bolts here, they have about the same tensile strength as a grade eight bolt. A lot of people think they're stronger, but they're actually not but they do resist rust a lot better. Now this little baby right here is not very common. This is a grade nine bolt. It has a tensile strength of about 180,000 PSI, so it's stronger than grade eight. But what's cool about it is it actually has nine marks on it, so you can't mistake it for anything else. Now metric bolts are a completely different animal. They're graded by a class. Now this here is a class 8.8 .8, and these are 10.9. Now, class 8.8 is very similar to a grade five and the 10.9 is pretty similar to a grade eight. Now, to measure a bolt, we're gonna use this bolt sizing gauge here. Just gonna grab a bolt here, check it out. These are standard, we can tell by the marking. And this is actually a one half. And we need to measure the thread pitch. And this is a 13, means it's 13 threads per inch. Now, when you measure the length, you make sure you start at the bottom of the head to the tip, and this one's actually three inches long. Now there's another cool tool here to measure thread pitch. This guy right here, you can see it fits right in there. This thing folds up, goes in your pocket. 